dears, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna make a super simple dinner. I just got off work and now dinner time. It's five ingredients and it's not very healthy, but it's yummy um, and super quick and easy to make. So let's go. Okay, so I have boiled water, first of all. Actually, I washed my hands first. Now with boiled water, I've got everything set out that I'm gonna use for this. This I'm not gonna use right now. This is just a side dish. So I got the agrotins and I'm gonna chop up this ham. I'm gonna do that real quick. Okay, so the packaging directions for this, I don't know why I got the, my flash came on. Um, I've actually preheated my oven to 450 and I've boiled my water. I have all the milk and everything out ready to go. I diced up my ham. So I'm going to open this container of agratum. Actually, I'm gonna make the water, the milk, the seasoning that's in here, stir, stir, whisk, whisk, add the butter, and then put the potatoes on top of the sauce and then add the ham. So let me do that. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm not sure if I told you that was my oven reach temperature, but um, it called for two tablespoons of butter. So I put that in with the half a cup of milk and two cups of boiling water. So now I'm gonna whisk this and I'm going to add the little seasoning packet that it came with. I'm trying to do this one handed. Eh, eh, not doing so well. Could be worse, I guess. Got a little on the side here, a little some right here, right here. Okay, okay so that's emptied. Now I'm just gonna whisk this all together. The butter's still a little clumpy. So whisk, whisk. Okay, that's pretty good. So now I'm going to add in the potatoes and you just drop them in. And I'm gonna stir this a little bit if I'm saturated with this buttery, milky, cheesy, all gratin water. Okay. So then when it's like that, I'm just gonna throw in my diced, oh gosh, I don't know how I'm gonna do this, people. Go in there, go in there. I try to get them pretty uniform and then we'll just stir it again stir it again okay separate doesn't look too appetizing right now okay so now I'm gonna pop this into the oven it says uncovered for 25 minutes so we'll see what it looks like when it's done while that's cooking, y'all, I decided to make me a coffee. So I'm going to make the ice leg roll. I have an espresso machine. I'm gonna make that. Now why that does its thing. I've already put ice, caramel syrup, and a little bit of milk in there. Then once the coffee has brewed, I'm gonna put that in there with a little of this Italian sweet cream. This is so good. It's just perfect, creamy, and sweet. It's really good, try it. And then I'm just gonna let this brew. Okay, so that's done. Let's pour it in here. gonna 
the Italian sweet cream. Put a little of this. A little. That was kind of a lot. But that's all right. No judgment. Oh. Stir it. Now that is delicious. I made my peas. I took it out the oven. I actually cooked it for 35 minutes, stirring, you know, in between maybe every 10 minutes. Then I went one step crazier and added some um, cheddar cheese and broiled it. And there you go. That's that. Let me serve it up. Okay, and there's it all served up. Super cheap. I think it cost probably less than $3 to make. Um, it's quite good. So try it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.